What up? It is Monday at 8.08 p.m. and I am actually making a vlog right now. Well, it may not seem like a real vlog because I'm not going to bother with the text and the thank you stuff today. Uh, whatever, man. Let me tell you about my weekend. I, uh, I had a cheeky Nando's with some top shelf banter in London. I got the footage on my phone, but, uh... I went, I went up to London, and I forgot to bring the memory card in my camera, so I didn't really vlog this weekend. I spent uh, Friday, came home from work on Friday, and I uh, waited for that video that we really... What do you think about the new video, week four, new show uh, on the channel that we're experimenting with? <coughs> week four, we're calling the show week four. And I think it's cool. I changed that Ross TV show uh, name to week four. So I think what I'm going to try to do is make some shows that don't really fit into the other categories of shows that we make. So not a vlog or a talk show or any other fucking Friday show that we put out. Week four, it's called. And that's awesome. And I think what I'm going to try to do is get some user-generated content. And fill in that slot every every month. Oh, time to wake up and go to work. So, uh, yeah, week four. That's awesome. I love that shit. Uh, that video, that video that uh, Sillyfoot put out was pretty fucking funny. I was laughing. But anyway, so week four we're gonna do that. So Friday I slept. Saturday I went out to London. We had a cheeky Nando's and some top shelf banter. And then uh, I just basically stayed in London and chilled on the couch all weekend and watched Shameless. Uh, my friend was like, oh, you should check out Shameless. <coughs> I'm like, fuck it, I don't need a new show. So I put it on, I watched the pilot. Now I started watching it on Saturday morning at 4 in the morning. We're Monday night at 8 p.m., and I'm on Season 2, Episode 11. So I've watched almost 24 hours of fucking television this weekend. I did nothing. Um, you know, and then on Sunday, I went to a trade uh, flea market, and I bought this new shirt. I'll fucking put it out. Oh, careful. Check out my new shirt, my new bathing ape fucking thing, whatever, whatever. Got it for five bucks. And so, uh... So that's what I did with the weekend. I couldn't really vlog it. I'll put the cheeky Nando's footage into the phone. Off the phone in next week's vlog, maybe. Uh, okay, so I did want to film some stuff before I... Whatever. <coughs> and this is what I want to show you right now. Mind the mess on the table. I'm a huge slob. But this is what I got going on right now. Actually, I want the light, too. Leave a comment in the comments section of the video about your weekend and tell me how your weekend was. Uh, let me turn my flashlight on. Because I love the audience interaction in the comments. I really do. Okay, I got this light. Uh, okay, so I went out and I... Well, I didn't go out. I bought it online. But I went out and bought this thing online. Sayonara Atomizer. Check this thing out. Oh, my flashlight's shit. So, uh, I got this Sayonara. It's basically just a sick little mod. Well, the mod is not what's sick. I bought, I got the mod for free. Whoops. Sigeli T150 set at 23 watts, right? And now this thing pops off the top like this. It's got a nice little splash guard in it. Anyway. So inside is a... It's a Canthal ribbon. Wrapped around a black ceramic rod. <coughs> and I only got one small dab left in here. So we're going to do the dab right now. Everybody's fucking talking in group chat. Okay, so this is my last dab. I've been saving it for the show. For the show, my real life fucking vlog. So drop that little nugget of fucking turd in there. And it's definitely on there. I'm not gonna pre. I'm not gonna pre whatever it. 
Okay, so we got to put the top back on. And this whole this is called the Sayonara Atomizer. I bought it from a place called Humboldt Vape Tech. And um, <coughs> just this little unit, just the silver piece. I got the mod for free, but the the Sai itself cost 75 bucks. It was like 40 bucks um 49 39.99 American plus a $5 upgrade for the glass mouthpiece. And uh, check this out, we're on 18 watts right now. I'll use this touch screen to put it up to 23 watts. That's all I need. You can run the, the canthal wire at, um, you can run the canthal wire at about 28 watts. You don't want to burn it out. And like, here we go, check this out. I'll do a fucking dab from way over here. Oh yeah. Whatever. Check this out. I'm standing on my tippy toes to do the dab because the fucking camera's so high up. Okay, check this out. I got a I got a Sigeli T150 turned down to 23 watts with a with a fucking Sayonara atomizer on top. I've been waiting for two weeks for this thing to come in, and here we go. Check this out. It's like a portable dabs, <coughs> not some weak fucking wax pen. Check me out. I did a 7.37, a 7.3 second hit. <coughs> I tell you, I tell you this about this fucking thing right now. I just woke up and did the dab, and uh, when I coughed just now, my anus flexed, and I felt like I was gonna shit myself because <laughs> uh, I haven't pooped since I've been awake for the last maybe 10 minutes. But uh, I'm going to do one more hit on the Sigeli here because this is mad fresh. And then I think I'm going to do like a proper uh, review of this later. And I think I got some more fucking uh, dab stuff on the way. So I'm going to do another dab and then I got a turtle head poking out. Mm, I'm squeezing it back in for real. It's like a Kegel but it's my anus. <laughs> okay, check this out. The 7.2 second hit. <coughs> ah, excuse me. Alright, so this is basically the vlog. I'm super stoked to get the Sayonara. I will do some uh, other stuff with it later. And I've been extremely redundant. Week 4, Sayonara. Uh, oh, I'll tell you one more thing then in the interest of fucking rambling on. So, I got, I needed, if, if you're not watching Grow Show, I'm, I'm growing weed, and on the show, I had a setback where I bought a heating pad so that I could keep my seed, my seedlings warm in my propagation tray because I'm having troubles controlling the temperature in the back room, right? So, I got a fucking heat pad off Amazon, but it had a defect in it, so I returned it, and I had my friend, excuse me, <clears throat> Had my friend buy me uh, another thing, like I gotta reimburse him, but they grabbed me another thing off Amazon, heating pad. <laughs> Fucking heating pad isn't scheduled to be here until between March 17th and April 4th. And it's like March 3rd now, so I gotta wait like another two fucking weeks plus for the heating pad. That sucks. Anyway, I've been rambling on for nine minutes. I gotta take a massive shit. So thank you very much for watching this episode of uh, Not Slim Now. Next week I don't have anything important going on, so uh, maybe spring cleaning. Who knows? i got to get the camper worked on. That's not happening next weekend. And i got huge talks about the gathering of the Juggalos. Maybe I'm going to go. There's a, from this date right now, they should be announcing it within two weeks. So we'll see what happens with that. Anyway, I'm seriously pooping in my pants right now I'm not lying <laughs> and uh, that's enough that's enough so thanks for watching this episode of the show I'll put out another one next week uh, all the regular shows are coming out and this Friday is a live why would you do that it's already been a month I can't believe it so enough is enough I'll talk to you next week thanks for watching the show and that's it whoop whoop <laughs>